What have I done? Mm hmm. Hotel. I went there. The bar. Okay, that would explain why I was in the bar. Also, hello! Welcome back to Trails in the Sky Blind. We're gonna talk to this guy and do some other stuff. Huh? Who are you kids supposed to be? Are you perhaps the reporter from the news? That's right, but how do you know about that? I like getting the scoop on things, but I hate it when people try and pry into my life. What business do you have with me? We're here representing the Bracer Guild. We were told that you had a requested an, ex an escort. Oh, so you've finally come, have you? I've been waiting forever for you guys to show up. So, uh... Where is Cassius Bright? Uh, well, the thing is, he had another job come up. So he's not even in Roland. I came all the way here so I could get a story on the famous bracer! Crap. What a waste of a trip this turned out to be. Don't... I don't get why you're so disappointed about, but... There's no need to get your boxes in a bunch. We've got you covered! I guess I don't have much of a choice. You'll have to do. Wait, did you just say... Don't get your boxers in a bunch? No, the we've got you covered part! What do you mean by that? It's just like Joshua said, we're your representative bracers. Oh, and here's our referral. Heh, <laughs> this has got to be some kind of bad joke. Are you trying to tell me that you little brats are bracers? <laughs> what do you mean, lady? This- Wow, okay. What an asshole. If you don't like my assessment, then how about you- uh, again, what an asshole. This clothing is specifically designed for those who wield a staff! And this looks like a skirt too! Are you blind? What a rude old man. Er, well... If you say so. You need a cut back at smoking, it's bad for your health. Uh, indeed. I'd be more than happy to introduce you to someone else, but I don't know when they'll be free. Ah, uh, I can't extend the deadline any longer. I guess I've got no alternative. Alright, rejoice you kids, I'm gonna leave this up to you. What a generous old man you are. I'm Joshua, and this here is Estelle. And you are? I'm Niall Burns, ace reporter for the Liberal News. Though we won't be working long together, I hope you'll do a good job. Hmm. By the way, where is it exactly that you want us to guide you? The way I see it, you need a trusty guide because you're headed somewhere dangerous, right? Right, my destination is Esmelis Tower. I'm sure you've heard of it before. Ha, huh. well, okay then. Okay. I guess we better go find her then. She said something about her orbital camera not working right, so she took off to the orbital factory. But she should have been back by now. If you're in a hurry, then wouldn't it be a good idea to head over there now? No doubt you're gonna take off to get your story once you meet up with your partner, right? Yeah, that's true. Alright then. Let's head straight to the tower once we pick her up. I guess let's do that, but first. Huh, that 
that's that's odd. Oh, there it is. Sorry for the noise there. That was really yeah. This is really professional, but. Okay, much better. <laughs> I I needed to grab something that was just a little out of reach. Uh, there we go. Wait, anything but that? I'll do anything you ask. Just please give me back my camera. It's worth more to me than my life. This is a problem. What should we do about this, Dad? You're the one who took the job, so you're the one who has to deal with it. What indeed. Hey, Dorothy! How long are you gonna keep me waiting? Niall, you've come just at the right time! Please help me out. Uh... Ha. Huh. Are you a clairvoyant or something? When you do the same thing that many times, even an idiot would know what was going on. Do you know this person? I'm sorry to ask this, but I... Can I get you to pay the repair costs? Fine, but I'll need you to write it off as a business expense. How much? The decorative clock and the repairs together are 2,000 Mira. HOLD ON! I can understand the repairs, but what's the deal with the clock? Well, I was looking around the store while he was doing the repairs and... I saw a pretty clock and when I picked it up, it broke. But I'm glad that we can write it off as a business expense. How wonderful is that? That kind of amount is not going to be covered! Hmm. Yeah. But the fact that he'll pay out of his pocket for someone else means he's probably pretty nice to work under. Sorry to keep you waiting, kids. Had to take care of a little trouble. Indeed. To help you taking the place of Cassius Bright, with whom we'd originally made arrangements. These young kids are... I'm Estelle. Nice to meet you. So Estelle and Joshua, you may be young, but you seem reliable. More Joshua, but you know, you're both fairly reliable in your own way. <laughs> I'm the new camera woman for the liberal news, and at the moment, I'm training under Nile. Why'd I get stuck babysitting this blockhead of a girl? The damn editor in chief. Relax, relax. Something good will come out of all this soon enough. I just know it. <laughs> now that we've got everyone together, how about we go and get our story? Sounds like it. Wait. Wait a second. Okay. That's how it's gonna be, eh? Well, they want to go straight to the tower, so I guess we will do that. Oh, wow. Okay, I see a problem here. My body chain is so long that it's really easy for a monster to hit me from the back. Yeah, this could be a problem. But I certainly don't want to fight all the monsters around here again. Like, I feel like I've fought them enough at this point. So, if we can at least make it to the tower, 
That would be nice. We're almost there. And we made it. Wow, this tower is really tall. I wonder how many floors it has. Last time we were here, we only made it up as far as the second. But judging from the scale, I'd say it probably has five or six? There should be five. At least that's what it said in the book at home. It was investigated some time ago. But it looks like it was abandoned after that. Uh... Really? Interesting. There are towers similar to this one in Bose, Ruin, and Zeus. They all seem to have been built around the time that the Liberal Kingdom was founded. My job this time is to uncover the truth about them. Dorothy, get me a few long angle shots of this place. Here we go! like that. Quit trying to act professional and just get me a shot using your usual style. I guess I shouldn't try to tone down my style just to look good. Well, I guess I'll have to do it in my own way. <laughs> oh, she is lovely. She says that she can't seem to ex She says that she can see the expression of the scenery, whatever that's supposed to mean. And believe it or not, she takes some pretty breathtaking pictures acting all ridiculous like that. I guess it could be considered a type of genius. The kind that's borderline insane though. Wow, people are sure never what they seem to be. This coming from Estelle, so. <laughs> Alright then, let's go inside. Well, head for the roof. I'm counting on you two, Greenhorns. Uh, indeed, there are monsters inside, so, uh, be careful. Man, I didn't think I'd be coming back here so soon. Well, I guess the first floor is fine. Oh, I did a whoops. <sighs> Every time I do this. Coral shell, waking is fire. Uh, our physical attack's fine? Yeah, that seems okay. No, don't hit her! I need to protect her! Damn it! Well, I- oh, that's interesting. That is very interesting. I guess I counted wrong. Or I read it wrong, rather. Okay. Whatever. We're good to go. Okay, nothing over there's something over here. But what's on the other side? Hmm. 
more monsters! I think that the, that attack guard thing means that they're resisting my status effect. That is my interpretation, anyway. Oh, hey! A Gregarious. I guess this is what the, uh. The, uh. What's it called? The Sephith that gives me the sensor stuff? I guess that's what it does. It gives me the description of the enemy and what it drops. And experience and just. Yeah, that's interesting. I'm not sure what I was expecting, but, uh. Honestly, this was not it. The information. There's the stairs, and... Okay. Level 3, get. This bridge is broken, there's a monster over there. Let's find the monster over here. Uh, larva monster living underground, leaves its HP from prey, strong against the wind. We're good to go. One experience point. You look simply marvelous! Oh hey, she blended it. Cool. <sighs> Let's see. Okay, that's broken. Oh, that's new. What is that? A desperately fluff! It has the ability to steal a minuscule amount of EP. Well, we better kill it. <laughs> oh. Hmm. Okay then. Let's do it this way. Seven? Joshua. Thank you. That apparently it had really high magic resistance. Go figure. I mean, it was a fluff, so. I guess we'll just mop up the rest of these now. Oh, I was hoping she'd say something interesting again. <laughs> hmm. Accuracy problems are not great. But, uh, we've just about got this mopped up now. There's one more to go, and I'm gonna have... Okay. Ow. But, uh, I just need to... There! And we're good. That's that thing. Let's move out! Oh, I even got a little bit of time! Presumably from the fluff ball. Okay. Uh, not broken. 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 Not broken. Let's see. Actually, let's use this. For you, at least, and for Estelle. Um. Hmm. 
Something like that should be good. Okay. Okay. Up we go. Floor number four. Here we come. <laughs> 